spit it out. Boom. Oh. Oh my God. Look at that. Welcome back to our channel, everyone. It's your boy Asamani, and today I'm going to be trying viral food hacks by Five Minute Crafts. Let's go. Look. So guys, for anyone who doesn't know who 5 Minute Crafts is, 5 Minute Crafts is this YouTube channel with 62 million subscribers, I think. And they're basically catching up to PewDiePie. They upload like five, six, seven videos a day sometimes. But basically it's a channel that gives us life hacks, things that will help you, beauty hacks, styling hacks. So I thought, you know what? I haven't actually used any of these and we don't know how legitimate it is. So in the name of YouTube science, Asalamani is here. We're going to be trying a bunch of these food hacks that they said work. I want to see how it goes. I want to see how useful, useful and practical it is. This episode will be called Trying Food Hacks by 5 Minute Crafts. Let's go. So guys, for the first hack, we're going to be using a egg carton and we're going to be basically cutting both these sides and we're going to be turning it into a sauce holder where we're going to be saving more space and hopefully it's more convenient. Let's see how this goes. As we just saw, we saw that they cut off both sides with a razor, but I don't have a razor, so I've got scissors. It's one off. That's two off. That's our sauce holder. Let's see how this goes. So guys, I'm just going to go ahead and say that food hack did not work. That's a big thumbs down because they accounted for only like balsamic vinegar and things that are very flat caps. But I mean, look at this, for example, this barbecue sauce, it's very cone like it's not going to fit and it's going to start falling over. Plus, if you can see in the video where I placed a bottle at the back, as soon as I took it out, the glass bottle, bottle that was on the corner straight away fell over. I mean. I'm gonna go ahead and say that is not a good food hack because it's not convenient or practical. Come on, five minute food class, what you doing? So guys, the second life hack is a really useful one, I thought. So I'm gonna go give it a try. Basically, they take a spoon and it's overfilled and instead of tapping it to the side and maybe falling over, they install a rubber band. I'm gonna do it, but I don't think they did it on a screw cap, which a lot of things are screw caps these days. So. I'm gonna see if this actually works and if I can seal it or do I have to keep putting the rubber band on every single time. Installing this, we've got this rubber band. So we are installing the rubber band. Now I don't think ever you can have, that's pretty good. So guys, I've taken too much, let's just take one. So it works, but look how much mess I made along the way. I mean, this is crazy. Like, if I move this, watch this, watch this. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy crap. It went flying somewhere else. Look, I'm going to say it worked, but practicality wise, eh, not too sure. One last thing, however, I do want to see is if it actually stays screwed. Can I leave this screwed or would this rip the rubber band? No, it's actually... Of course you can't. Look. It works, but it's not practical. So I'm just gonna give it a half. Let's get on with the next one. So guys, for this next life hack, all you're gonna need is a toothpick, a lemon, a knife, and a chopping board if you like. A lemon, whenever you use it, you're not gonna use the whole thing, generally speaking. Like if you wanna just put a little bit on top of your fish and then you're done. I've always thought, whenever I cut it right, I'll cut this part. Let's just say, and I'm like, Okay, that's done. I'm going to use maybe half of it, let's just say, for example. Then I'm like, man, this part always starts getting brown. What do I do? So they came up with a pretty genius solution. You get this. Use a toothpick. Boom. And it doesn't fall and it stays fresh. This one is actually very good. This is the first time I tried this. So put it back in the fridge and Bob's your uncle. So I'm going to give that a two out of two star practical and... It actually works. Good job, Five Minute Crafts. So guys, for the next hack, what we're gonna try is putting potato into boiling water and then removing it and putting it straight into ice cold water. Now what that does, Five Minute Crafts has said that if you do that, the skin, it'll automatically peel off. So we're gonna be trying this out. We're gonna be put the, putting the potato into the boiler for around 10 to 15 minutes in boiling water and then we'll remove it and put it into ice cold water. 
Let's see how this goes. If this works, this is seriously crazy trick. It's so good. Let's go. So guys, we're back with the potato. Here it is. It's really hot. It's steamy. If you can see, and we've got some ice cold water, which has some ice that's already been mixed into it. You can see them floating. And we're gonna see if this actually works. Oh, it's still hot. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, okay. As you can see, it's taken off all the damn skin. As soon as I put it into the cold water, it started falling off and peeling off. That is crazy, man. Highly recommend this. Definitely works two out of two, three out of two if I can, because Oh my God, this is nuts. So guys, this next trick is actually really cool. All you need is a plastic water bottle and one egg. And this is for people, maybe they like to only eat the egg whites and not have the egg yolks or use it in their hair or for some beauty products or just throw it away because it has high cholesterol. This is for you. So I haven't done this before, but basically, we're gonna crack open an egg. A little bit of ASMR. Now I couldn't find a smaller water bottle, this is the only one because we don't usually use water bottles. So get the water bottle, this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna put some pressure, see how I can, I'm grabbing it. Ooh. Oh. Ah, look at that, and then we're gonna just spit it out, boom. Oh, look how perfect it is. Look at it, it's like a, what? Look at it, it comes out, it's like a little. Oh no, I popped it, damn. There goes my fun, but it definitely works if it's still in its yolk. But that's so cool, man. <laughs> I'm gonna give that a two out of two. You better try that at home as well. Wow, I like this, I like this. So this next hack is actually very useful. I've just got some protein powder. This is, this is such a bad thing. Okay, we're just gonna put that much, right? And all you need is cling wrap and your phone. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna use your phone, but your hands are dirty, right? This is what you do. Put your phone into the cling wrap. Boom. You have that. And we're gonna scroll up now. We've got a menu here. We're watching, and our hands are dirty, and we're like, "Oh my god, I don't want, I don't want to use my phone. I, should I use my phone? Shouldn't I? It's so dirty. My hands, my poor little hands. What do I do? Oh my god. Oh wait, I've got cling wrap on, so I can use my phone. That's a good one. I didn't know it was gonna work because sometimes it gets very temperamental. So it still works. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna give that a two out of two for that because that's pretty useful. Yo guys, for this next one, I'm super excited, man. Oh my God, I can't believe this actually exists. So till this day and age, I'm 24 now. I have been living under a rock. That's right. Who has been giving me pomegranate and cut it in sorts of ways like this, 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 and I'm like, it's so annoying. I love pomegranate, but it's so annoying to open it. So I just got this from Woolworths in Australia. $4.50 for one. So if my mom sees me opening this for a video, I'm practically a billionaire in her eyes. Not a millionaire, I've skipped the 1,000 million. I'm already a billionaire in her eyes. If this works, I will take my pants off and run to Afghanistan. No, I won't. First thing they said is cut the top, which we're gonna do as such. I hope I'm not getting too in. Okay, we've already cut a little bit more in than expected. Next thing, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna have to cut right in between this because they've got these small crevices that they hold by, apparently. So let's see if this works. Yep, I don't think I've cut too accurately because look, as you can see, my knife has gone sideways. So we've probably missed, but it's okay. <laughs> I've missed another one. <laughs> I hope this works, it's actually so good because I actually really like pomegranate. Oh my God, look at that. It opened up like, oh my God, that was a perfect cut. Oh my God, yum. Holy mother. It looks like Vegeta just came out of his time capsule or something. That is nuts. Video is over. Video is over. Sorry, you have to hear that. Holy mother, it tastes so, that's so much more easier than like breaking and having a punch on with it. Look at it, it opens up into six chambers, that's crazy. Oh man. I'm gonna be buying so many more of these. It's so juicy. Oh 
Oh my God. Five minute crafts, I love you. I love you. Thank you.